today going guys my name is Soxmaster today we're going to be doing a uh, another video of LS video 4 and uh, we're going to be driving the uh, I don't know what year this is uh, I know it's not 2015 it's got to be it's one of the newer chargers um, but anyways um, when I'm using this charger don't know what year it is uh, but there this is the newest release of the charger uh, it has blue lights um, so this is one of the new vehicles uh, besides the Impala I know I was going. I said in uh, Wednesday's video I was going to use the Impala, but uh, uh, with the uh, blue and red uh, lights. But today we're going to be using this. Um, so the only th there there is a new mod, as you can see. There is uh, there is you know when you're parking the lights or whatever you like to say. These are on um, while you're sitting here. Uh, so this is what it's like. You turn it on and it's like this. Turn brighter and then you turn it off and this is what it's like so it's gonna be really good for radar and, and pulling up to people's houses and, and stuff like that but there's only one thing with the mod is that every car that's parked that's turned off has the uh, lights like that as you can see have those ambulances over there they have them uh, they have them on right now um, but it's called a corona mod um, and that's not in the description um, but anyways this is what it's like with the blue lights as you can see it's bright it has the traffic advisor in the, in the back of the vehicle uh... it's a really good vehicle i really like it i hope you guys enjoy this uh... episode and uh... i'm gonna do a uh... i'm gonna have the domestic disturbance i'm gonna go ahead and take that call um, anyways let's go ahead and be in route to that uh... i'm just gonna go code three to this because this is in the uh, grocery area uh... anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I really do and like this ve uh, vehicle. And um, but yeah, some of the vehicles are going to be have bright lights and stuff. But uh, yeah, it's whatever. Uh, anyways, we're going to be ten. Oh my God, get out of the way, people. We're going to be 1097 on scene. I don't know where they are. Need to talk to the caller right here. Put your hands up. Why are you trying to fight me? Why are you trying to fight me? Get down on the ground. Sorry if I'm not pointing my gun at her because I'm trying to give me some drink. Alright, so we're going to have her in custody. Go ahead and put her in the back of the vehicle. I have no clue what she's, why she's coming at me. Why she wants to fight me? She's a caller. I don't understand. I'm just gonna pull off the side right here. All right. Is there anybody I can talk to? I can't talk to him. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and talk to her. Uh, that's my phone, by the way. Um, Go ahead and talk to her. Really? Get back in the, you get in the vehicle. Get in the vehicle. <coughs> okay. So that guy uh apparently I was supposed to talk to the caller and that uh was supposed to happen. Which, uh, it did happen. Um, I wish I wouldn't have caught, uh, talked to the caller, but I don't know where his body is. His body's supposed to be, like, right here. We're going to have to clean our outfit and stuff like that. Just some, you know, get some health and uh, armor on. Um, uh, there we go. Alright. Uh, <coughs> Let's see. Okay. Anyways, um, we need a breathalyzer and um, searcher. So we're gonna do that, and our big hair is sticking out of, out of my vehicle. So, anyways, we're gonna get her out since she's not drunk. Uh, we're gonna get her out. We're gonna bring her to over here. Come on. There we go. Alright, so we're going to search her to see if she has anything on her. Um, 
yeah but anyways uh, the reason why I, I want to um, I want to tell you guys the reason why I'm not really posting on Tuesdays and Thursdays I'm just doing now pretty far is because really there's no other videos to post I mean I have stuff I could post but then I don't uh, I don't really uh, what is she doing get back in get back in I'm getting sick and tired of you trying to get out and get in get in I'm gonna get her prison transport because I was gonna take her in myself, but I'm gonna get her prison transport since she's getting in and out and crap. So I'm gonna move out of the way. Anyways, the reason why, see, this is what it looks like. It looks really bright, but it'll be alright. Um, anyways, uh, I don't really have anything to post, but uh, this week I had two videos I could post, but I decided not to because one. I just wanted to post LSPDFR and 2. Uh, the new update for Xbox One for the DLC for Black Ops 2 came out uh, today as you were, uh, as I'm making this, which is on Thursday, not on a Friday. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I, I wanted to play the D new DLC uh, for Black Ops 3, so I'll next week I'll get back to it. I'll uh, make sure I post Tuesdays and Thursdays video. I have two videos made. And uh, they're not ready to upload yet, but uh, I have two videos made and almost ready for to be uploaded and everything. So I'll make sure that they're not patched before I do it. It is uh, GTA 5 glitches, by the way. I'm just let you know because I know a lot of my subscribers are GTA 5 people. They love GTA 5 glitches and stuff. So, anyways, I'm gonna be 10:8 uh, and Code 4 from there, and we'll be uh, we'll see what else goes on. Uh, the alert. We'll go ahead and take this traffic alert. I don't know where they are. Okay. This, this this skin is a Blaine County Sheriff's skin. I, I realize that, but I'm not in the Blaine County. It'll be alright. We're just going to use it for now for the city because uh, I don't have a skin on this yet, and I'm using a city outfit. Plus, I just want to use it in the city. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and run the tag while we're sitting at the red lot. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and. Okay, they didn't even. This, they're being weird. They're running for me. Alright, so we're gonna be in, uh, in pursuit with this uh, vehicle. Oh, dang. Alright, so, anyways. I'm gonna get me. Uh, I was gonna get a helicopter, but uh, what's the point? All right, go try to pit him already. Jesus. All right, get out, get out, get out, get out. There's two of them. Get out. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. No. Oh, okay, hold on, guys. Um, I accidentally clicked a button real quick. Shoot. Okay, I accidentally clicked a button. It's uh, to go back to your windows. I meant to click control, and I accidentally clicked that. So, uh, sorry about that. Because um, I'm trying to block off the road. And you had to click control U to do it, and I clicked the Windows button, and I was fixing to click U, but I accidentally uh, clicked the Windows button to take me back to the Windows screen. So, anyways, sorry about that. Uh, I hope that didn't mind, or you didn't care, because, I mean, we came back to the game, so it didn't matter. Alright, we're going to go ahead and move our vehicle, because we have to clean up this scene right here. Go ahead and put the vehicle right here. Alright, so we're going to have to clear... Okay, the dead body's already gone. I don't know what that was about. Okay, and we picked up the weapon. Um, I can't remember if they had any flags or anything, but the driver was the guy with the bat, and the the guy with the gun was the passenger, so it all worked out fine. Um, at least the driver is going to jail for uh, fleeing and everything, so... He's got a lot of charges. I forgot to search the vehicle, but it'll be alright. Anyways, we're gonna call a prisoner transport. I'm, I'm not gonna take him in. 
and uh, this is a good way to start our uh, episode off with uh, pursuit and a d uh, domestic disturbance. That's a good way to start it off. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and fix our vehicle. And let's let's go ahead and clear the that uh okay uh, with the uh, we call it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and take that motor vehicle accident. Anyways, we're going to be uh, 10 and code 4 from here and go ahead and take uh, that motor vehicle accident. TZ, question driver. Alright, we're going to go ahead and close road off. Uh, and we're just going to... Okay. Okay, we're going to go ahead and talk to them. A deer ran out onto the road. I had to swerve to miss it. Come on, is it gonna say anything else? Anyway, so they said that uh, a deer came out of the road, but it's not. I don't know how the driver's dead. It doesn't make sense because how would the how would the mule be like that way, and how the van come that way? I'm sure they, they, I know they came from that way, and they, they had to come from this way and hit them, but I don't understand how their vehicles turned that way, I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and, let's see, why does it not let me stop them? Alright, ask for ID, I'm going to go ahead and run her ID. Okay. Alright, so she's won by the LSPD. Um, oh no, God. Ah, that pisses me off. It really does. What happened was, okay, whenever you. This is. Sometimes it happens. It happens like, like here and there. Um, but. I don't mean to smack them because you know how you have that menu that says uh, give them citation, ask for ID, or give them warning. So I wanted to get out of that menu. Instead, I when I got out of the menu, I clicked B, and so when you click B, it slaps them like that. And so that's what happened. And uh, I had I accidentally killed her, so now it's pointless to even. That was all pointless now. So they're both dead. It was very. It was, it was pointless. I'm gonna go ahead and clear road and do uh, do uh, 20 miles per hour to 32 miles per hour, and we're gonna pull our vehicle up here. That mule won't be able to be moved. All right, so we got a. Um, it looks like all of the scenes almost cleared up. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and clear um, the roadblocks. Uh, and I'm going to be 10 in code 4. I won't be able to tow that mule off because there won't be a tow truck can't pull a mule or any kind of big truck. So we're going to be 10 in code 4 and uh, yeah, we'll see what else goes on. Alright, so we're going to be pulling over this uh, vehicle right here beside me. They're being an idiot and they want to pull her up beside me. Anyways, we're gonna be pulling them over for uh, getting, rec I guess you could say, reckless driving. I, I don't, I don't really know, cause they was just pull right beside me like randomly. So we're gonna go ahead and pull them over here to Simeon's garage. This that's the safest place. Uh, so, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and pull behind them. I had to do a traffic stop because I haven't done one this episode. So. Uh, because we all we've been doing is doing calls, so I wanted to change it up a little bit. Um, and so yeah, as you can see, you know how the Corona mod it uh, puts those lights in, so when all cars are parked like that, you can see right there those three cars are parked with the tail lights on, like or the hello no And go ahead and ask for the ID, run the ID, and then. Um, we're gonna go. It will go from there. Mm -hmm. 
God, I forgot the last name. The names are so weird on this game, so let me, uh... Alright, let me get a, uh... I could probably remember that name, never mind. Yep, got it. Alright. Okay, so anyways, she her licenses are valid and no active warrants. We're going to go ahead and... Um, it says some scales known for uh, waiting drugs. Uh, and driver seems nervous. So, we're going to go ahead and get them out of the vehicle. I'm going to go ahead and put them uh, under arrest. Uh, we're just going to detain them for now. And then we'll uh, go from there because... I'm not really sure if she has scales or anything like that, but if she does, she needs to uh, go to jail for that. But if she does it, we'll um, we'll just let her go and give her a uh, citation because for doing that. Uh, so far, we found a wallet, um, and let's see what else we got uh, in the passenger and back uh, of the trunk. Forged IDs, cards, so. I'm guessing she's going to jail now because of forged ID cards. A gym bag. So, oh, didn't mean to do that, but go ahead and breathalyze her. Go ahead and search her. Not drunk. Uh, well, um. So let's get further. Okay, let's go ahead and sit her up. Let's go ahead and put her in the uh, vehicle. Get in the damn car. All right, so there we go. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, tow her vehicle. We already searched it. She's gonna be arrested for reckless driving, forged ID cards, uh, and that's it. Uh, that's pretty much it. We're gonna go ahead and pull to the side like this and turn the lights off and uh, call a prison transport. I saw him spot that on. Alright, the uh, tow truck, I have no clue what he's doing, but anyways, we uh, the prison transport's here and it seems like the tow truck's gonna be a while so we're gonna go ahead and be 10 and code 4 and uh... we'll see what else happens alright so we're gonna be taking a possible home invasion i never took this call and it's one of the rarest calls you get ever like this is this is one of the rarest ones so we're gonna go ahead and be in route code 3 to this because i don't know if it's gonna be a false alarm uh, I don't know. So I'm gonna go ahead and go code three to this. Home invasion is our very important. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go ahead and try to hurry up and get there. Oh my God, idiot! Now I gotta turn all the way around. Cause some idiot wants to have to pull uh, go on the interstate. So uh, yeah, this is one of the rarest calls. I've never took this before. And it's one of the rarest ones. I've never took it. I've never seen anybody took it before or anything. So we're going to be already 1098, uh, or not 1098, 1097 on scene. We're supposed to be talking with another officer that's here. Uh, this doesn't look like a home invasion at all. Alright, so we're, uh, hello. hello, sir. Hello, uh, 181. Screw you! What happened to uh, what happened to you in this house? Uh, there, there was four people in the house. They were unlikely to be unarmed. Thank you, Thank you for the information. Roger that. You're so dumbass. That's fuck. Hands in the air. Put your hands up. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and. Oh my god, oh my god. Look the idiot! 
Move, move. Oh my god. Would you stop calling me for one minute? <laughs> Hold on a minute. God. She's... Moron. I got somebody trying to call me, and I'm trying to make this video, and it's really hard. I'm going to go ahead and uh, end the episode here, uh, so, so that way I can answer the phone call. Uh, like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.